In this tutorial, I'm going to walk you through the API Connect Developer Portal. Now, we're going to enable the Developer Portal for the Sandbox Catalog. A Developer Portal is a web application for exploring, subscribing, sharing, and providing feedback on the APIs that you have published. For now, choose the Sandbox Catalog, click the Settings tab, and click the Portal sub-tab. Now select the IBM Developer Portal radio button and click Save. The developer portal will take some time to become active. When it's ready, you'll receive an email with a link to confirm your account. Now, let's take a look at the portal. If you have enabled your portal and confirmed your account, go to Settings, select the Portal tab, and click the URL to navigate to your developer portal. To get started with the developer portal, click on the API Products tab. It contains a collection of products published by the organization. Browse through the catalog and find the product that suits your purpose. For this demo, we'll be working with the API Smart product. Click it to view the product details and plans. Select the API on the left to view its operations. Click on an operation to view its details and you can try a sample request using any of the display languages. In order to use this API in your own application, you will need to create an account or log in with your existing account. After you've been logged in, a new tab called Apps will appear on the top nav bar. You need to register a new application in order to use the APIs that are available to you. Click on Apps and then click on Register New Application. Enter the title and description of the application and hit Submit. A message will be displayed on your screen saying Application Created Successfully along with the Client ID and Client Secret for your application. You must supply the client ID and client secret when you call an API that requires them. Make a note of your client secret because it is only displayed once. Now you're ready to subscribe to the product of your choice. Open the API Products tab, click on the product, and hit subscribe. On the pop-up menu, select your application to sign up for this plan and hit subscribe. The product will be displayed in the subscriptions. Now go to the Product Detail page and test out any operation from the list of operations. Click Call Operation. You will get a response as displayed and now you're ready to use the API in your own app. Thanks for watching!